Ladies and gentlemen, now for your official introduction, the fighter fighting out of the blue corner, weighed in at 55.7. He's 17, stands 5'6". He fights out of CTC and hails from Ronda Wales, Joseph Thomas. And his opponent fighting out of the red corner, weighed in at 56. He's 16, stands 5'5". Five, five. He fights at a powerhouse fight club and hails from Wakefield, Joe Scully. Your referee, Mr. Simon Studnitsky. Oh, the action continues on here with the 55 kilogram amateur MMA contest. Joseph Thomas representing CTC making his debut. He's fighting out of the blue corner. He's in the black shorts with white trim as he takes on powerhouse MMAs. Also debuting Joel Scholey. He's in the black shorts with red. Touch gloves. Oh, wow. Oh, beautiful shot there. Yeah. You can see, uh, see all this straight away. Scholey has quick hands. Yeah, he does not want to engage on the feet. One of the ways you can avoid being hit is immediately initiate the clinch. He's chasing that double and gets it. Lovely work. Right yeah. now, though, Scholey right back up against the cage, hips square, so he might be able to post and force himself up. But yeah, Scholey's doing the right thing here, trying to keep his head above his opponent. As good. soon as it drops below. On to the back, one hook in. I might have to give up on that. Well, again, noticed he was going to get shocked off. Changes the grip. Now Scholey has to hand fight. Oh, but Dragged down, down again and on the back now. One hook in. Is that the second in straight away? I mean, it flattens him out. Oh, no. This is a bad position here. Bad position early in the round. Both still dry. Yeah, really not using those punches to try and feed that choking arm in. But Scholey doing the right thing here, trying to get flat to his back so he can push on the feet and get away. Yeah, but again, you're going to start eating shots that you don't need. Gets up again. But, ooh. Can't see what he's chasing from this camera angle. But figure he's looking to try and set up the choke. Yeah, he's been pretty dogged going for this rear naked choke. Oh, beautiful body triangle there. And that... Good Lord, he made that look easy. And yeah, Scholey here needs to try and turn towards. Yeah, he told the, the wrong way. And now, but a great, because he's just going to back ride him now. See if he can readjust, twist into the side a little bit, but still going to pull his man round to the back. And wow, <laughs> Joseph Thomas. Yeah, so Not here to make up numbers, is he? Not at all and doing a really good job just switching that body triangle from side to side. And again, the eye can lock it down now, it does. And look at the squeeze there. Is he gonna try and trap the arm with the leg? I mean, good Lord. And again, those body triangles are so yeah. brutal. And again, turning the wrong way. She only needs to yeah, he try and plant the foot. Yeah, he needs to try and shoot his left leg underneath that locking leg. Yeah, there we go. He's yeah. in a better position now. And now he needs to try and step over that bottom leg, get his hips over the top of it. You fighters make me laugh. He's in a better position now with another human being <laughs> strapped to his back. Yeah. Throwing... <laughs> oh! Oh, that's a good first round for the CTC prospect. Yeah, very, very good round for Joseph Thomas. See, now you, I know you were looking forward to Choli because of the stand-up, the striking. The, yeah, but bias on the table, I love the powerhouse but, guy's striking. But let's be honest, I think Thomas must have heard you because he didn't give any chance at all for no. Choli to get into a rhythm on his feet. No, none at all. He, he totally understands where his strengths and where his weaknesses are, and he's gone straight for it. And that's not to say that he's not going to be handy on his feet. He, I think he recognized it early on that yeah. Scholey was going to be very aggressive, very fast with the hands. Yeah. 
and why take a chance of getting clipped if you can take a man down and put and him on his back? Exactly. And now you've got to think, Sholey's going to know for the rest of this fight. Yeah, he can put I me get, down. Yeah, if I get taken down, I'm going to be stuck there for the remainder of the round. And what does that open up for Thomas on the feet and vice versa? Absolutely. What takedown opportunities does he get? Although him? I'm not sure anybody told Sholey that because he is there bouncing in the corner, ready to go, looking fresh as a daisy. And yeah. we'll see if he can change things up in this round. He looks eager no, to go. No, wasn't going to touch gloves. <laughs> Front kick down the middle from Thomas. Oh, lovely. Lovely jab and then a lead leg kick. Gosh. See, anything to close that distance, right? Yeah, oh, lovely right hands by Sholey. Sholey now needs to separate. He needs to use this underhook that he's got, turn towards it to get his head free, and then create space and get back to his striking. Because this is playing into the game of Thomas now. Well, he was happy to grapple all of the... F so he'd be happy to grapple here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he doesn't want to be the one pressured up against the cage. But right now, he's not taking shots. And he can look to try and improve by a big knee up. Yeah. But that big knee up the middle. Yeah, is now giving Thomas the opportunity to cage wrestle. And surely he's going to have to get off the cage. Oh, oh in on another double. Uh, single, single now. Single. Steps, steps around, it's gonna try and just drop him out. That was beautiful. Yeah, fantastic wrestling there. Yeah, the wrestling coach over at CTC gotta be happy with that. Oh, that yeah. just, that was beautiful. And Sholey trying to control that near side arm, but. Looking really, for a Camaro lock, maybe? Possibly, but I mean, really, he needs to be establishing frames, create a little bit of space first before he. Yeah, he look, sorry, little knee to the body there. Oh, gotta give him a shot. Going for the head and arm choke, he, but he needs to be on the other side. So he's gonna look to transition over. And that's what Sholey is doing everything in his power to stop at yeah. the moment. Sholey's got his arm now on the correct side. And got. That knee shield through. Needs to try and get his feet on the hips now. Either go two butterflies or two feet on the hips. You don't want to be one in, one out. Yeah. Because then it's much easier to pass. Right now, it's, it's still one in, one out. But I love that, jo again, Joseph Thomas, not rushing, looking to get position. And Sholey is framing on that arm. It looks like he's looking to set up maybe a triangle or an arm lock of some kind, but the, the pressure of Thomas is just, yeah, well, it, it, it's fantastic at the minute. But it's not such a bad idea from Shirley because it's going gonna, it's gonna to make Thomas sort of think about these top positions if he can threaten with a triangle or something from yeah. the bottom. I mean, generally speaking, you want to use submission threats to get back to your feet, and you want to use the threat of you getting back to your feet to give you submissions. submissions. And at the moment, Sholey's sort of just going all in on one at a time. And that's making it much harder for him. So he was sat down in a half guard there for a moment. Tried to get the side control, but Sholey again gets butterflies in place. But there's no doubt, and this is not where you want to be if yeah. you're Joel Sholey. And that's two rounds now. A tighter yeah. round. Yeah, definitely a closer round. But still, but. I think, for the CTC man, Joseph Thomas there. So, yeah, now, now you want to see some different strategies from Sholey. Like, does it mean changing up your strike selection? Like, do we start throwing now uppercuts as opposed to straights right. to dissuade him from shooting in on that takedown? Do, do we try and shoot our own takedown? Do we see what he, he's like off his back? Although it seems to me that the moment that the moment that Sholey throws that that one errant shot that Thomas is more than happy to close the distance, yeah. maybe eat a couple in the scramble to get a hold of that body and from that moment yeah. I mean you saw, Thomas was willing to Superman punch his way through the air just to make just the connection just to make the connection so yeah I mean th th this is why guys like Khabib, guys like Demetrius Johnson, they all say your foundation needs to be really strong grappling. Because yeah. if you can't overcome a good grappler, you're going to really, really struggle yeah. to get your striking going. Well, three minutes to separate them now. Joe Shirley in the black with red. Oh. Answer, big one, two, right to yeah. open the round. So Shirley needs to control his, his pressure now. Yeah, he hold because the center and not march into the oh, clinch. Nice rim. knee to the body, but again, given that. And again, and lovely. And now oh. he's on the single. 
And surely, takedown. absolutely, got a little bit of time to work. To Has hit. to get past that leg. Yeah, needs to look to transition out of this uh, this guard here. Now he's got his head loose. Oh, oh my goodness! I mean, just a beautiful sweep. What? Really, really nice work. Sholey has uh, has an arm trapped on the bottom, but that's just going to be a stalling measure. Yeah, fine. You, you, you're not going to submit me, and I'm just going to lie here in side control while yeah. you pin my arm. Yeah. Although, knees to the body. Yeah. <laughs> knees we, to we, the body we, wouldn't be a bad idea. No, they're, they're, uh, they're always a good shout. But it, just great control. Oh, Chasing the... Yeah, fishing for a dart, it looks like, or a guillotine. Well, he's locked it up. Now he's made the mistake of letting Sholey back to his feet. Here, Sholey needs to think about getting his head up, well, up he's and out. Trying to fight that end. Nice knee. Great knee from the CTC man. And wow. again, ends up on top. That was a really great hip throw there. Beautiful, just trying to make life difficult. Straight palm to the chin and if it, if cross it, face. He's got to be careful, though, about extending his arms like that. It gives Sholey options for arm locks, but not when he passes his guard. Yeah, it's beautiful. And again, shove him up into the cage. Don't give him any room to move on that right-hand side. And yeah. pepper, the body with, pepper the body with knees. Yeah, just a real suffocating style. Oh, it's here, perfect. This is what he needs to lay again. Why? engage in a in a fight that it's 50 50. yeah of course and, and here he's looking to sink in ahead and arm trope. again i mean he's just been just been a man just been relentless on top he's gonna look to transition through to mount here yeah surely surely needs to if it, 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 it sounds strange but he needs to turn as if to give up his back so that he doesn't get choked well, because just clinging onto half guard here, he is going to get past eventually. That yeah, cage might just be saving Sholey at the moment. Oh, coming through for the knee cut. So that I mean, that stop. does look tight. But it needs to be over on the other side. Yeah. Sholey might just about survive. Well, he's going to. You can see that little bit of air, little gap between. And, but that's control, yeah. absolute control from Joseph Thomas. What a great three rounds for this young prospect. Yeah, fantastic performance. I mean, wonderful. Yeah, and I, I, I know that Joel is going to be frustrated with himself right now. But, but I, you, I, funnily it, enough, you know, I you were talking about his stand-up a couple of fights ago in the Hardy Wallhead corner. We see Josh Hamilton, Josh Hamilton, on the feet, like that young man. Yeah. There's very few that are going to cope with it. Yeah. But your grappling has got to catch up first. Yeah, absolutely. So striking base to start, phenomenal. Just Chuck Liddell it, man. Wrestle in reverse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You either need a, a, an unbelievable sprawl or you need people worried about your own, your own double yeah. leg, your own single leg. Because, yeah, you can't just be a striker in isolation in this game. But what a fun fight that was. Mr. Seth Khan's in the cage. Fighters Let's turn it over to him. Cage. Give a quick shout out to Total Trades, sponsor here at BMF. Mr. Seth Khan will make it official. Ladies and gentlemen, after three hard-fought rounds, we go to the judges' scorecard. All three judges score this in favor of your winner. In the blue corner, Joseph Thomas. Please show your appreciation for Joel Scully.